the console's car? Okay, we're gonna keep this short. I'm already late for the DA. First up, Phelps, Bukowski. We got a report of a brand new Packard abandoned in an empty lot off 2nd Street between Olive and Grant. DR is one Oswald Jacobs says the vehicle was dumped in his backyard. There's a patrolman on site. Get down there and see what you can turn up. Any questions? Good. Get going. Okie dokie. Go. Rimsky, O'Halloran. Intelligence has information on a stolen car racket. Down this way. An abandoned vehicle. Can't tell the good ones, huh, Phelps? Sounds like there's more to it than that. Nobody dumps a shiny new Packard unless they borrowed it without asking. Okay, let me drive this time. Very funny. Come on, my intense protege. Is he still talking to himself? Locations. Current location. Oh, right. Don't hit the car in front. You hear about Adrian? Brought in Seattle, threw him out. Wife says she's gonna take him back. Women generally show more compassion. What are you talking about? Adrian dumped on her. He was humping the secretary. Margaret should show some pride. Pride comes before a fall, Bukowski. Talking from experience. Oh my god, I'm not good at driving. You have got problems, Phelps. Okay. Did that. I knew it was behind us somewhere. It's close by. Just around here. Yeah. Down here. All right, here it is. Saw some credit cases. Bust some asses. Phelps, traffic. I'm off to Hulahan. Cars down the alleyway, detectives. It's a bat, I can see. Car with tires missing. You got a call about an abandoned vehicle? Yes, sir. The car has flags. Might be some kind of diplomatic vehicle. Has anyone touched this vehicle since you arrived? No. And that Jacob's bird over there was on station before I got here. We'll talk with him in a moment. Give us some time to look the place over. Sure, take your time. He's a sore-headed old son of a bitch anyway. Okay, let's look for clues. There's a bat here. Can I talk Give me to some stuff? room, huh? I have to get this done. More matches. Probably not. Nope. Not a clue. So saw so bat. There's a bat around here. Something shiny. Property of Dwayne Bros. Dewey Bros? registered as a clue used to manipulate objects search points of interest hold hold when the camera zooms slightly to light to zoom in there we go combination wrench must have used it to remove the wheel lugs got it got a new location Is 
Good balls. Seems irrelevant. Is it bad? Somebody's blank here. Something here. A license plate's been taken off. We'll have to use the registration to trace the owner. Stealing the wheels is for amateurs. A car ring would have stripped it in a warehouse. Okay. Another clue. California Motor Vehicle Registration Certificate PR706. General. Any name? Name style Picard Clipper. L. Davis. Got it. In the boot. Look for any other clues. Can I hear any sounds? Okay, let's ask this woman. You all seem to be standing around. Nope. Can you be working? Let's talk to the old dude. Oswald Jacobs? That's right. What exactly happened here, Mr. Jacobs? Last night, I was looking out of my window. I like to keep an eye on what's going on. I can understand that. You see this empty lot? Damn kids play stickball here. Always breaking my windows. Always asking for their ball back. Can we get back to the car, Mr. Jacobs? Don't be impatient, Sonny. Anyway, last night, I see this brand spanking new Packard up on bricks. Witness report, in this case report. Did you see who stole the Packard? Hell yes, I did. I saw three goddamn Mexicans going to work on it. <laughs> Mexicans. Oh. Uh, now. I could eat. I don't know. Can I call him a liar? I don't. I think he's telling the truth, but he could be mistaken. I'm going to just go doubt. I have no reason to go doubt. You're sure it was three Hispanics? Not some local kids you're looking out for? Hell no! Little sons of bitches live around here. I'd love to see them in juvenile hall. But you got your wires crossed, son. Okay, I got that wrong. Hispanic suspects. Let's see what he's doing. Seems fine. After the uh, Mexicans left, you didn't go anywhere near the car? After I scared him off? No, I didn't go anywhere near that car. Oh, he's lying. Definitely lying. Doubt. Hmm. Now, did he say something that gave himself away? I don't think so. This has got doubt. You went out to the car. Once they were gone, you had to take a look for yourself. I was curious. There you go. Feel law against that. So what if I took a look around that car? You can't be accusing me of nothing. Vehicle stripped of parts. What exactly did you see them take? They was working on the tires. That's all that was took. He's lying again. Down. Right. So what did you take, Jacobs? Do you want my partner to pat you down? I found a notebook in the glove compartment. I was going to show you. It's on the chair on my porch. He just looked like he's lying. Look at that was his voice. Thank you for your help, Mr. Jacobs. You can speak to Officer Thibault about signing a formal statement. Got one of the questions wrong. When you get the car out of the way, if you could come back and do something about those kids. Well, how about we bring you an umpire's mask? 
sits here. What is this? 1947 agenda. Ivan Fransko something something. Oh, that's it. We'll pick it up again. Oh. Open it up. List of names. John Madison. Okay, so we have the owner of the vehicle. A degenerate. I'll run John Madison by R and I. Uh, what does it say? Is there anything in nice eyelashes? Stanley Mesa, lovely speaking voice. Just people's names and qualities. Walter Moss, good natured. Ben Brown, gentle boy. Teddy Hopper, full lips. Jimmy Cobbett, baseball fan. Uh, he likes curry flavored candy. This is nonsense. Okay. Anything else? William Dewey. It's one of the brothers. This looks like business rather than pleasure. Angelic but fisty. I think we've wrung this place dry. Let's find a game well. Let's go. Telephone there. Let's see if I can use it. Use it. Press on to use a game well. Twelve forty-seven. How can I help, Detective? Could you run the name Dewey Brothers? Possibly a dealership or car mechanics workshop. One moment. Dewey Brothers Packard Dealership, six two nine Figueroa Street. Got it. Can you put me through to Michigan twenty-four fifty-eight, please? Connecting you now. LAPD, ma'am. Can I speak to John Madsen, please? He's at school, officer. Uh, what's this about? Is he in trouble? How old is your boy, ma'am? Just turned 16. Wrong person, Mrs. Madsen. Sorry to disturb you. What was that about? Any messages? There's just one message for you, detective. A four-door Packard diplomatic license number, Paul Robert 7 06 was reported missing this morning by Juan Francisco Valdez. Could you have him brought in? I, th I think his name was in the book. Detective. He's demanding an audience, as he calls it. Thanks. Can you get a message to Captain Leary? Tell him we'll be in as soon as we can. Thanks, ma'am. Can you cordon off this lot until we have the vehicle impounded? Yes, sir, Detective. We'll follow up on the owner. Get a statement from Jacobs, and I'll read your report back at the station. Okay, let's go to the, uh, what was it, mechanics? Locations, do your brothers. Get in, my friend. I'm driving. This has got to be the 50th abandoned vehicle call we have caught this year. One more and I'm going to go crazy. This seems Not quite a lot of them. Cases. Are you kidding me? This is barely even police work. Of all the bad guys in this city, we get lumped with the ones who can't even be bothered to keep what they... Let's look at the map. I'm here, I think. I'm trying to get to the... This way? Let's answer that call. Okay, I can't answer the call. I think I missed my chance. Ish. Slow down. X. 
experience points. Oh, no. I think we're about there now. Oh no, oh no. Oh, god damn it. Look out! Is it here? Okay, I think it's around the corner. Just here. Every time I bust up the car, they take it out of my salary. It's annoying. Because I don't know what I'm going to use money for. Can I use money for anything? Don't tell me, let me guess. You were making your way past the lot, caught sight of the new model four door, and couldn't help yourself. You could see yourself in that car and just had to take a closer look. Well, I can't say as I blame you. <laughs> LAPD, Mac. We'd like to speak with the owner. That's me, William Dewey, proprietor at your service. Let's give him the business. We're investigating the theft of a Packard belonging to the Argentine Embassy. Are you missing a combination wrench? I don't know, Detective. But I know how we can find out. Follow me. Doesn't seem like he's lying or covering up anything. Can I get a drink? No. We keep all our tools in here. Uh. Mind if we look around? Be my guest. You sure you guys aren't interested in a new car? Huh? Maybe a used car. I have some nice used cars for guys in your wage bracket. I'm sure we had like a red label last Why time. Give us some alone time, Dewey. Red Those must be Gabriel Del Gronto. But we'll just play this game anyway, no? That's not right. Can I move it around? That's not right. Try that one. Cool. Pretty sure it goes on top. Ooh, puzzle games. Perfect. Gabriel Delgado is missing a three quarter. It sounds like a hell Hispanic person. Hispanic name? Hispanic name. Let's look for clothes, anything? Sounds. Oh, something coming. Is it here? That's oh, probably this guy. I think that's license plate. Maybe this is going to help us. Mm -hmm. Something here. No. Good to me. no. Let's talk to this guy. Mm, it's junk. Nothing here. These license plates? No. no. We need diplomatic plates. Nothing here. Let's talk to this guy again. Let me talk to him. If you don't mind, we have a few questions. Uh, association with Vladis. Was that the guy, the embassy? Packards are great cars, but this doesn't look like the kind of place favored by foreign embassies. How do you know about this? I don't know Valdez. The embassy bought the car. All I know is he must know a quality car when he sees one. There's Tantrit. 
So Valdez was just driving by and he saw the car. Yeah, something like that. Happens all the time. Whereabouts of Alda yes. Seems fine. Where can we find Delgado? I don't know. Sure as hell isn't here. Doubt. Address, Dewey. Or my partner shoves her head in a car door. Okay, all right. Cause he has to know the address of his employee. Three Hill Street. And tell him from me. If he ever shows his face around here again, I'm gonna kick his butt from here to Kingdom Come. One more last thing. A wrench from this dealership was used to strip the wheels from a Packard last night, Mr. Dewey. A couple of Hispanics were seen taking parts. We've had a spate of thefts ourselves. Comes with the location. Even bastards to steal anything the minute your back is turned. Hmm. You sound truth? Uh, truth. That's it. Like I said, the workshop's too close to the street. It's difficult to keep an eye on it. We'll be keeping an eye on you, Dewey. Got two wrong the word that and you one like correct. Cooperate with the LAPD. We really ought to take more time over the Packard Phelps. Let's head back to the empty lot. Any clues here? Get out of here. Empty lot. I think I've got all the clues on there. Is that my car? Uh, let's go to the restaurants. Set as destination. KTI Radio reminds you. Make sure okay, it's behind us. Social security number. Applications Where's available at your local post office. This is KTI Los Angeles. Hey. Quite the lie. Can you Here we are. Make it. Gabriel has to say for himself. I just hope our archangel hasn't already flown. Let's talk to these guys. That's the cop in the newspaper. It's me, guys. Super stuck up. What the hell is this guy doing? No, I can't talk to them. Mm. I mean, what apartment does he live in? Uh, where do you see a number three marked on that door? Number three. <laughs> mm. Yes. Pregnant chica. LAPD, ma'am. We're looking for Gabriel Delgado. Gabriel? We're from the police. Policia, you understand? Yes, I understand. Could you come inside? What is your name? Ana Rodriguez. Is Gabriel Delgado here, Anna. Ms. Rodriguez? No. What do you want with Gabriel? Is he in trouble? Stay where you are, Miss Rodriguez. We need to take a look around. But he is not here. I have told you. Check out the surrounds. I'll stay with the broad. Hmm. Think here. Uh oh. So how far Look at that. You, it's one of those flags in the car. Nearly twenty weeks. Right. So how's it gonna be when you go into labor and he's not around? You are wrong about Gabriel. He will be a good father. Already he works hard to provide for us. Unless you help us here, Anna. Is that him? Won't be seeing Papa for a Don't need his car. Time. Around here? Anything? What's that? 
Look like anything. Okay. A Virgin Mary. Nothing. Don't think this is any use to us. Drug the lamp. Hmm, what's this? Doesn't tell me anything. Nope. Nothing here. Not that again. T. Serving breakfast for two, Adam? You should have cleared up. Man, he just left recently, I'm sure that. Anything here? Let's talk to him. We ought to take more time over the Packard, Phelps. Let's head back to the empty lot. I've been there like ages. Let's talk to him. Motive for auto theft. Why did he steal the car, Anna? The customer insulted him. He has his honor, no? Hmm. No. There must be more to it, though. His name was in that guy's book, so let's go three. He steals cars to support you and care for the baby. How can you say that? What makes you say that? Mm. Stolen Picard, stolen missing license plates, back of a Accusation. Missing license plates. Missing wheel. Yeah, his book was weird. Let's use the book. This the one. I have my own job. I work at Union Station. If I have to, I will bring up our baby. That is all I have to say to you. All right. Didn't go as well as I wanted, but... Locations. Okay, let's go to the police station. That's the cop in the newspaper. Come on, guys, you know anything? If olive oil comes from olives, where's baby oil come from? Mm, that's my car. You know the way. You can drive. Hopefully this meeting will progress the case. Francisco Valdez in for questioning. Sure do, Phelps. Your bird's an interview, too. And get this, he's wearing gloves and doing his best not to touch anything. Can you beat that? Tell me, Phil. I want to keep this guy waiting. It's this way. Parker. About time. Are you the senior officer I requested? It's me. I'm Detective Phelps, and this is Detective Pukowski. Have you any idea how long I've been waiting to speak with you? I am needed back at the consulate, and you keep me here like a common criminal. All right, friend. Let's take a deep breath and start all over again. Mr. Baldez. Council General. I insist on my full title. Council General? Purchase history. Theft of vehicle. Let's go for the first one. Where did you purchase the car? 
My secretary and driver arranged the purchase. A disreputable place, Dewey Brothers by name. As soon as I can have it arranged, I will have my Hispano Suiza brought up from Buenos Aires. True. He's telling the truth. Wait a minute, is he telling the truth? Yeah, no, no, he's not telling the truth, lying. His name was in his own book, so uh, that he must have arranged it. Lie. You're lying, Valdez. You made the arrangements for the car. Call the embassy. I decided the color and model, but was not involved in the transaction. You're lying. Mm, so I'm missing license plates. Missing wheel, registration slip. Uh, no, this one. Yeah, basta! I will stand no more of this. Okay, that didn't go anywhere. Theft of. Consul General, we have located your car. Can you tell us how it was stolen? It must have been stolen from the council garage. Terribly inconvenient, of course. I want the perpetrator soundly flogged. Unfortunately, we don't do that here, your worship. Yeah, let's use intuition because I'm getting stuck. Remove an answer. Uh, doubt. You have a pretty good idea who stole the car, don't you, Consul General? Are you going to tell me or do I shake it out of you? There's no call for violence. I suspect a disgruntled boy from the car dealership. You have a name for this kid? Gabriel, like the Archangel. I have no surname. Association with Gabriel. So tell us about this kid, Gabriel. You had a run-in with him? Mechanical. A presumptuous young man who did not know his place. He presumed to ask me questions. We do a lot of presuming here in the United States, Consul General. It comes with the turf. Hmm. Okay, let's use the intuition again. Remove answer. Doubt or lie? Uh, lie. You fuck young boys, Valdez. Are you a madman? This will cause an international incident. Look. Oh. Can I not use? I can't use that anymore. He's not book here. Danny, Ben, Miguel, Tristan, and got him. Got him. <laughs> Full lips. Ring me bells. I'm sure we can come to some arrangement. Gabriel, spill it. A beautiful but impertinent. I mentioned rendezvous and the young man went quite insane. I thought he was going to kill me. <laughs> I was prepared to pay. We'll be in touch. Consul. Two out of three. That's pretty good. Let's nail this kid Delgado and wrap this thing up. Two plus an experience. I think I'm going to have to go back to that woman and speak to her. Finished with Valdez. Thank God. I'll get rid of him in a couple of hours. So we'll have some more questions. And she will talk. Hey, keep it down. Hold <laughs> on, one. My little girl just got to sleep. Yeah. Wasn't this a clue? Why well, she won't talk I can to tell me? Tell you are lying. Your lips are moving. Anything? Let's go outside. See if we can go here. Yeah, he had a car in the picture, so where's his car? Oh, 
almost there. Oh, yeah. Music's going. That's nothing. Nothing again. Ooh, license plates. Is that diplomatic? Those California plates, I don't know what this is. Yeah, that's the plates. Got him. Man, I should come out here before and talk to her. There's a lot of license plates. Let's just try this other license plate here. Nothing. Anything else? Nothing here. What were those ties? Got him. Looks like Valdez gets his wheel back. Mm, it's nothing. Mm. Anything around here? And down here? Definitely missing something now. I'm a bit of a stuck. I mean, the breakfast thing. Does that mean you're still here? Is he hiding somewhere? Got him. <laughs> I think I'm there now. But Gabriel is not here. I have done nothing wrong. He has though. Last contact with Gab Gabriel. Tell us the truth, Anna. Has Gabriel been here? Gabriel. I'm calling Gabriel. I seen Gabriel. For at least three nights. You keep lying to me, and I'll send you and your baby to jail. He lives here, but he hasn't come home. She lying Sorry. again. Food. Enough, Anna. There are signs all over this place that he's been back. He was here last night. I have never seen him so angry. She's telling truth. He went out to his shed and put some things in it. I don't know what and I don't want to know. We got them. I love him. Well. Oh. Plates, dim yeah, diplomatic plates recovered. We found a license plate matching our stolen vehicle in the shed. Add in the assortment of parts, and we can make Gabriel for a dozen other thefts. It's time to get serious, Anna. You must ask these questions of Gabriel. I know nothing of these car parts. She's acting suspicious. Oh, uh, view notebook. Mm, stolen plates. Stone wheels, stage slip, notebook, plates. I'm just gonna go doubt. Doubt to this. Then tell us where he is. If your baby is born in prison, Anna, the corrections officers will take it from you. You will see your son or daughter through a metal grate for half an hour a week. The start line is on First and Santa Fe. There is a spillway under the bridge that leads to the river. Many policia have wrecked trying to follow him. We will put in a good word for you, Anna. As far as we're concerned, this sits with Gabriel. Starline? That sounds like a straight race to me. It's gotten out of hand this last year. Mm. No wonder Delgado has such an eye for final. 